Hi, welcome to Atmasters. Today I'm going to talk about something different. Uh, this is about our group project that we did for our microcontroller technology subject. I assume that some of you may have learned about this subject. Anyway, you can refer to PIC microcontroller programming tutorials in YouTube for more information. Okay, our project was a problem based learning aka PBL project. What we used for this project was the project board with PIC microcontroller 18F4520 and ICD2. We used uh, port A to port E for connecting keypad, LCD switches and LEDs. It's quite interesting to learn this subject and programming and we actually love it. For more references, I provided the link to download an ebook about PIC microcontroller project book. So let's get started. So our task was to build up a home security system. Also we had some breakdown list to complete. They were detecting the intruders at the house and introducing an energy saving method. The system should be armed or disarmed whenever you want to do and it should be able to handle the communication between the user and police departments, fire departments and emergency departments if any cases happen. So first thing we did was wiring up the devices and assigning them to each port. We used entire port D for LCD and port B and port E for switches, port B RB0 and RB3 for red and green LEDs and port A for keypad and touch sensor. So after wiring the program, we programmed this into the board from MPLAB IDE uh, 8.60 uh, version. So let's start the demonstration. Switch on the power. Now the system is in sleep mode and every lights and turn are turned off at the beginning. As can be seen, if I touch the sensor, it will exit from the sleep mode, turning on the green LED and blinking, meaning it detects the user and or somebody is in the house. So the system is now able to function as an energy saving system. When somebody gets injured in the house, he or she is able to call the police by using numbers in keypad. So now we are going to arm the system. After arming, if any of the switches is turned on or sensor detects something, then the countdown starts from 60 seconds to zero, prompting the user to enter the password to disarm the system. This is for intruder detection at the area and the house. After entering wrong password at several times, then the alarm starts to beep. Then it sends the signal to original user with the call police or exit or disarm the system. If the person enters the correct password, he or she will be able to grant the access to the system. In our project, our password is uh, A0BC. Uh, after all, it's quite hard to program the keypad, but with the help of our teacher, Ma'am Kalai, we were able to finalize the program, except the record in the password entry time. Finally, I take this opportunity to thank my friends and Ma'am Kalai for being such a great helping hand and providing inexpensive details and knowledge from the beginning to the end. So, my friends are Mohamed Salim, Mr. Ming Hong, Mr. Stuart Law. So, thanks for watching. I'm Tikshin Soisa from Actmasters. And don't hesitate to subscribe our channel on YouTube, The Actmasters, and website www.actmasters.com. Have a nice day.